Maybe Bickerstaff and Coach, I don't know if you're aware of this or not, but during your 11 games uh, on the bench, your Cavaliers are seventh in the league in assist percentage. So you've been moving the ball a little bit, uh, which sets up our next video here with uh, Sam Jones, who is your coordinator of player development. Yeah, this is uh, an old school thing here that you don't see a lot of guys working on much. Uh, but, you know, ball fakes, you know, fake a pass to make a pass help set your teammates up. And, you know, that's an area we really tried to improve in. And like you said, uh, being seventh in assist percentage uh, is a great step for us. Today, I want to talk about ball fakes and pass fakes. Two fakes that we use a lot in the games, but I don't think we talk about them enough. And I don't think we practice them enough. So let's get right to it. Let's talk about the ball fakes, okay? Now, a nice ball fake is same basketball base. All right, and very rarely are you in the basketball base the entire game. You're either coming off the screen, you get in your base, or you're dribbling, you get in your base, or you're tripping threat. Let's go off the dribble first, okay? So I'm handling here, I'm gonna fake to make. And notice how I kept the ball really tight on the fake. You wanna fake a pass to make a pass. And if I fake low, the defender's gonna drop his hand and wanna fire the ball right over his hand. Notice how they bring it low, pull it back to give him a chance to recover. All right, so we're going to fake to make. Let's get a couple reps with that off the dribble. A pass fake is a pass never made. It looks exactly like a pass, but you don't make the pass. Not one of these where you can't really sell it to the defense. You want to make a nice, aggressive pass fake, allow the defense to shift, and then you can pass it to the open player. Okay, let's get a couple reps on the pass fake, and this time let's go off the catch, all right? So if I spin it out off the catch, my target's here. I'm gonna pass it here, shift the defense, fire right in on time and on target. All right, same thing. Fake to make. I'm gonna go the other way as well. Fake to make. Notice my left foot is always my pivot foot, and my right foot is my active leg, so I'm right handed. If you're left hand, you might wanna use your right foot as your pivot and your left foot as your power foot. All right, let's try it again. Fake, make. Again, this works excellent against zone defenses to really shift the defense and pass to your teammates. And listen, so our, our head coach, uh, J.D. Biggerstaff, always says, you're never wrong if you're doing something for someone else. So practice your ball fakes, practice your pass fakes, and do something for someone else. Get your teammate open for an open shot or an open layup. JB, that's pretty good advice that Sam attributed to you. Uh, you can't go wrong by helping somebody else, and that works for basketball and life in general. Right, and that's the thing about it is so much of this stuff, you know, we learn from sports, how we interact with one another off the court too. So, uh, you know, the game of basketball is a beautiful thing. You know, the lessons we learn, how we share the game, how we share with one another. Um, you know, that's why I suggest that all of us play team sports at some point.